Hi hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Santero. Hope everyone is well. So I just got done reading for Leo. And Cancer will be last because they went first last cycle. I have no idea what this next card is. I shuffled them. And we're going to go in the honor system here that I'm not checking them to see what they are. I just let the universe make the decision. <laughs> Libra, you're next. This reading will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for August 2020. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards if you choose to do anything at all. It is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. If it does not resonate, that's okay too. If you feel so inclined, check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of the cross-watcher. And cross-watchers are always welcome here at my table. So, if I forget to say it later, thanks for stopping by. Libra, August 2020. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, August 2020. Go over what's going on with you, what's going on with them... Obstacle in the solution. Okay. Why are you here, Libra? Ten of Cups reversed. Ten spilt cups. Not feeling so froggy, are ya? Could possibly be some family issues, maybe? Okay. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Nine of Pentacles reversed. Maybe you felt like they were a little bit codependent, a little bit needy, possibly. Okay. What do you think of them? Strength. Could be a Leo you're dealing with. There was some huge polarities here. This took trust. Okay. But it was an equal give and take. Huge differences. I mean, she's got to trust that line to not rip her arm off. And that line's got to trust her to not poke him in the eyeball with a stick. Know what I'm saying? I mean, that's trust. That's strength in a relationship. That's a bond. <sighs> what do you want from them? Seven of Swords in the reverse. You wanted honesty. <laughs> Perhaps there was some things not brought up, not mentioned. Perhaps there was some lies... You just wanted them to be honest. Okay. How do they feel about you? Six of Pentacles, they see you as a very fair person. Okay. They felt like the relationship was equal. What do they think of you? Seven of Pentacles reversed. You are not the most patient person in the world in their eyes, Libra. Or they didn't see it going anywhere. They thought maybe that it wasn't going to grow into anything. What did they want from you? Four of Wands. They wanted stability. They wanted that soulmate connection. They want the door to stay open or still be open. We'll get clarity. What's the obstacle here? Two of Wands. The obstacle here is going forward on the path and letting go of the past. Okay. What needs to be done? Three of Wands, somebody needs to wait. Ah, okay. I don't know if you need to wait this out or if the other person does. Could be a little bit of both. Let's get some clarity real quick. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards and the table for Libra? So, Moon Rising Venus for the month of August 2020. Libra, 
Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Cards bent. I need to go to my storage unit and get those Encyclopedia Britannicas out. <laughs> One more. Now I'm going to shuffle them this way to try to straighten these out. That's slightly better. Okay. You're too rough with the cards. You're probably right. I'm rough with a lot of things, so. Sometimes I don't know my own strength. <sighs> One comes out flying without intention. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Happiness issues, lack of patience. Could have been yours, could have been the other person's. Oh my gosh. Knight of Pentacles, maybe it was a little bit slow moving and somebody got impatient. Could have been solid, could have been stable. Why is the Nine of Pentacles reversed here? Real quick, one card. Nine of Pentacles reverse, one card. Four of Swords reversed, clinginess, codependency, restless energy. Maybe you feel like the person was a little bit restless. Needy, codependent. Not gonna beat that dead horse anymore. Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords reversed. Okay. Maybe they were a little bit bat poop bonkers over you. Hmm. I'm not seeing that as coming out of a state of restlessness. Not with that Four of Wands or Four of Swords reversed. They were bat poop bonkers. Why is strength here? Oh my gosh. Two of Cups. Yeah. You felt connection. Absolutely you did. Not beating that dead horse anymore. Why is Seven of Swords reversed here? Honesty. You wanted honesty. Ten of Wands reversed. You want them to release burdens that they haven't released yet. Often when someone is needy, clinging, and codependent, it's because they're still hanging on to something. King of Wands. A little something, something, sugar and spice. I'm not going to reiterate on that anymore. Could be that, or it could be you want forward movement, but you want honesty and you want them to release whatever they got to release. Why is the Six of Pentacles up right here? How the other person feels about Libra. Six of Pentacles upright. Why are you here? Two came out. Six of Pentacles reversed. King of Cups reversed. You see, he was a fair and honest person, but possibly the connection wasn't quite what they thought it should be. If things weren't equal, like someone was given more than the other, someone was possibly completely emotionally closed off. 
maybe they feel like yeah that's what I'm getting out of that you're a fair and honest person but you just couldn't equally give slightly emotionally closed off why is the seven of pentacles here why is seven of pentacles reversed here thank you Eight of Swords, it wasn't going to go anywhere. It wasn't going to fruit. They think you were all up in your head about something. You were consumed by something. Possibly. One more. Star card reversed. You hadn't healed from something. Okay. So, you still had a lot of inner work to do. You still had healing to do in their eyes. It wasn't going to go anywhere because you were consumed by other things. Two of Wands flies out. It was the f no, Three of Wands. You were waiting for something. Possibly you were waiting for a ship to come in. Something. It was a timing thing? Maybe the timing just wasn't right. Or why is the Four of Swords here? Or sorry, Four of Wands. Why is the Four of Wands here for what the other person wanted from Libra? Hi. Four of Wands. Wheel of Fortune. Wow. They wanted you to be their next chapter. Wow. I had a four of wands on top of a four of wands. They want the stability. They want the foundation. They want the celebration. They want the connection. They want the old to close out and the new to come in. They wanted you to be their next chapter. Wow, Libra. Wow. That's amazing. All right, what was the obstacle, Two of Wands? Why is the Two of Wands here for the obstacle? Seven of Wands. Battling that inner demon. Maybe someone was fighting for control. Eight of Cups reversed. Moving forward on the path, letting go of the past. Dealing with inner demons, possibly someone else is returning to the situation, maybe. Or the co the return? One more. Three of Cups reversed. Yeah. Knight of Swords. Opening the communication back up. Someone getting a getting a handle on what's going on internally. Getting a handle on the situation. Possibly someone had someone return. Could be a third party situation. There's two threes on the board. One of them's reversed. They may have other things they need to disconnect from. Maybe you have other things you need to disconnect from. Essentially, it's letting go of the past and forward moving is the obstacle here. Communication. Getting a handle on things. Gaining control. What needs to be done? Three of Wands. Why is the Three of Wands here? Six of Wands upright pops out. Waiting for the return. Waiting for the return after the battle the world. Waiting for cycles to close out so new ones can start. Somebody obviously left something hanging out there. One well, more on that, then we're going to get some advice. Justice reversed. Waiting for things to balance back out, because right now they're not. Let's 
to get some advice. Libra. Hanged man in the reverse, five of pentacles in the upright. The longer you stay hung up on a situation, the longer you're going to be left out in the cold. The longer you take to accept the fate of a situation, the longer you're going to be left outside looking in. Empress reversed. Four of Cups reversed. You'll never know if they could have been the... Oh, sorry. Five of Cups reversed. You'll never know if that could be the connection. If that could be the one, as long as you're still staring at the three cups of the past. Until you turn around and you look at the two full cups still sitting there, you'll never know. But eventually, you got to walk away from the spilled cups and turn around and look behind you. Pay attention. Ten of Cups reversed, Five of Pentacles reversed. Until you decide to fill your cups again. Still, the outside looking in. Eventually, you have to fill your cups back up. But you gotta come in out of the cold. It's like a cycle. It's like a catch-22. Nine of Pentacles reversed in the Page of Cups. I don't know who this one is for. This may be special advice for someone special. If someone seems a little bit needy, clingy, and codependent, you might want to be careful of what's in the cup that they're trying to hand you. Okay, Libra, this has been your reading for the month of August. Let me know if it resonates. Thanks for stopping by. I gotta get ready to go to my bread and butter job. Much love. Be blessed, and I'll catch you guys next time.